Executive Director of the Equal Rights Trust, Dmitryna Petrova, believes the time has come for Guyana laws against same-sex relationships to be revised since it could be violating human rights. Guyana is one of many countries that signed on to the United Nations Universal Human Rights Declaration. She said Guyana's 1997 Prevention of Discrimination Act was meant to provide a more comprehensive set of provisions to address issues of discrimination, especially especially those of race and gender. Ghana remains one of 10 Caribbean countries where homosexual acts are illegal. Voluntary, with inf well informed consent, consensual relationship among adults in private is something where simply the state should have no business to even look at. A piece of legislation or two or three which contradict the constitution and and it is true that a court has not explicitly said that they contradict the Constitution, but they contradict the Constitution. The Equal Rights Trust is an independent international organization whose purpose is to combat discrimination and promote equality as a fundamental human right and a basic principle for social justice. Secretary of the Society Against Sexual Orientation Discrimination, Sasod Vidyarata Kisun, has issued a call for the government to enforce and implement the anti-discrimination laws. We're asking for enforcement and implementation of the anti-discrimination equality law. So even though we might have it already in law, is that again, when you bring proceedings and you have to know how to bring proceedings, you might have to provide legal aid. The government, we ask the government to provide legal aid for those who can't afford um, lawyers to address these um, remedies and to actually look at things like the rights commissions. You, you have the policies in place, but sometimes we do not recognize that the people who are affected cannot necessarily access those policies because of the issues of discrimination. So that is why, um, so there are going to have to be specific measures. It's not just about having the laws and leaving it there. There are ways of monitoring the implementation of those laws. On Friday, Sassod released a draft report addressing the issue of discrimination and plans to begin a series of consultations on the topic. Mark Moore reporting for Capital News.